Hello everybody, today I have an HVAC video for all of you. This particular video is going to be an experiment to see whether or not I can improve the efficiency of my carrier air condenser unit. Now, before we get to anything, do not attempt what you see in this video because you can get yourself injured. So, anywho, let's get started. Normally when the AC is running, the fan blows air directly up into the atmosphere. But that's not the case for this particular unit here. This unit actually blows air from the fan out from the side, which isn't supposed to happen. Normally it's supposed to blow directly up into the sky, but however it blows onto the side, which is not good. It reduces the efficiency level of this unit. So as a result, this is what I decided to do. I know this might look a little nerdy in a way, but I have decided to put my three-speed blower fan motor on top with my 18-inch condenser fan by LAU on top of the fan guard. And while this unit is running, this will actually um, improve the efficiency level. When this is running and when both fans are running, it'll improve the efficiency level because the fan actually blows air directly from the inside of the unit right up into the sky. Now, before we turn it on, I'm actually going to be turning this top fan first to see how much air it blows. So here's my rotary switch. I'm gonna switch it to the first position so that we can get it started. So without further ado, here we go. So, I don't know if you'll be able to hear me talking when I put the camera over the mic, but um, you'll hear how much air it blows. It's crazy. It's madness. And it even pushed my camera up a little bit more, which is pretty interesting. So, now that I gave you a quick overview of how much air it blows, I'm going to also turn on the condenser fan, too. But I, hopefully, that when this AC turns on, it doesn't shake anything off. Because I'm also going to be turning on my condenser fan as well. But I'm not sure if I'll be able to do it in synchrony. Meaning that I'll turn the blower fan motor on when this turns on. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and flick the AC on and see what happens. So as you can see, it's currently running and what I'm trying to do is make sure that all of the hot air is being blown directly up into the sky. And it's actually working. It's actually improving the efficiency of this unit here. So, and I apologize for the wind being deflected into the microphone because of my hand. I'm just feeling to make sure that the air is hot. And sure enough, it is. And I'm actually very happy with the outcome. Sorry if the fan looks weird with, you know, both fans running. So I'm going to turn it off and see what happens after this. So I'm going to turn it off. So as you can see, the top fan slows down. And then what happens is that the air is being deflected. And as you can see, the fan is rotating in the opposite direction, which I find to be very strange. So, yeah, what the heck? Let me go ahead and stop it with my finger and just make sure that the motor is aligned in the center. So as you can see, as you can see right now, it's not blowing hot air from the top. It's not blowing air directly in my face. But when I have this fan on, it makes a difference. So yeah, it makes a very interesting difference. So I just switched it off because the motor is a little misaligned. And I do not want this motor to be ruined. 
plus all of the excessive vibrations from the motor tend to move. So anyway, hope you enjoyed this little experiment video. And if you did, then please be sure to like, comment, rate, and subscribe. And thank you all very much for watching.